All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So Global's Purple Dragonstone is finally here. Over the past couple days, tons of people would not stop asking me, yo Tiger, where is Global's Purple Dragonstone? Man, like we're supposed to get it. JP got them for their anniversary and they were able to buy LRs with them. I wanna get them too, but they're not in the shop. They're not in the news. There's no mention of them whatsoever. Is this another global shaft or did Bandai forget? Like what's going on? And I was like, honestly, I don't really know, right? Cause I know we're supposed to get them for sure. Cause we found a new purple Dragonstone asset in the game files when we got the last data download. So clearly they're gonna be available somehow, but I don't know why they're not in the shop right now. I don't know why they're pretending like, or acting like, you know, it's not a thing in the news, but uh, you know, maybe we'll have some more information later on, right? Like once we get closer to the release of the LR banners. And as it turns out, I was right, cause we got a four megabyte data download about, I don't know, 15 minutes ago. And at first I was like, what was it? Like there was nothing added that was nothing new, right? And then I checked the news and as it turns out, they finally added the purple Dragonstone packs as well as the purple Dragonstone shop to the game through this data download. And uh, let me just show you guys real quick what the packs look like. So essentially there are 77 Dragonstone packs plus a bonus purple Dragonstone for, I mean, $44 Canadian, which obviously is not the same currency that a lot of you guys work with. So if you live in the States, then maybe it's 35, 33 USD. And if you live somewhere else, that's gonna be a different price. But for me, it's $44, which I believe is cheaper than the JP packs because JP had a hundred stones for their packs, right? So it's gotta be cheaper. It's gotta be cheaper. You know, there's no way they kept the same price and, and just gave us less stones. That would be too crazy. Okay, so I'm assuming it's cheaper than JP's 100 stone packs and up to three of these are available for a total of three purple dragon stones. And we're gonna pop back to the news here and see what Bandai has to say. Okay, so it says fifth anniversary special select characters Dokkan Festival is now on. Use the treasure item premium Dragonstone 5, basically the new purple Dragonstone, to recruit special select characters to your team. Special lineups that allow you to recruit multiple characters are available in this event. An SSR character with a leader skill that strengthens a certain category or basically a category lead will be available in the lineups where two characters can be recruited. In addition, an SSR who can be token awakened into an LR will be available in the lineups where three characters can be recruited. All right, so basically for three purple dragon stones, you can pick up one of the OG five LRs, like the five original summonable LRs in the game. We got STR Broly, Tech Goku Black, AGL Majin Vegeta, Fizz Trunks, as well as <sighs> Int Gohan, yo, I never want to see this kid's face again, okay? Like, if you guys want to understand why I hate this unit so much, go watch my 200 stone guaranteed LR um, summoning video, okay? Because I hate this unit with a burning passion. Anyways, for three purple dragon stones, you get one of these guys plus two bonus characters. So for Broly, you get the Rathor Broly as well as SDR Goten. For Goku Black, you get Tech Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta and Fizz Trunks. For Majin Vegeta, you get AGL Super Saiyan 2 Angel Goku as well as STR Boo. For Fizz uh, Trunks, did I, did I call him Trunks before? I think I said Majin Vegeta, right? Anyways, uh, Fizz Trunks, you get STR 17, Int 18. And then for Gohan, you get Int Cell as well as Int 16. So. Yeah, if you guys are missing these units, um, you know, these LRs can still be good, even though I feel like Broly is quite niche and outdated at this point, mainly because of his lack of defense. And he's really only good, I feel like, for World Tournament and maybe a few other like story events where there's a lot of enemies and need to farm those events, like he might be good for those. But even then, there's better attack all units these days than him. So in my opinion, he's probably not one of the top choices. Uh, Goku Black can still be quite good. He can still hit really hard. He can still be pretty tanky uh, after a couple super attacks, so that's not a bad choice. Majin Vegeta can still hit really hard, but lacks defense for sure. Uh, Trunks is quite balanced. He has good damage and pretty good defense as well. 
And Gohan, even though I hate him, is still one of the premier nukers in the game, right? If you give him a good amount of orbs, he can still hit really, really hard. So, I mean, he does lack defense, as with, you know, Majin Vegeta and Broly, but uh, he's not that bad. So, yeah, if you guys are missing them, those are available for three purple dragon stones. And then for two stones, you can pick up one of these category leads. You got Ultimate Gohan, Jiren, uh, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, Super Full Power Saiyan 4 Goku, Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta, Fizz, uh, no, AGL Turles, Fizz, Vegito, Super Vegito, Omega Shenron, uh, UI Goku, as well as Int Angel uh, Frieza. So uh, those are your available category leads for two stones and also a bonus character for each of them. Um, I'm not going to list all of them, but you guys can see. And some of them are quite good too, right? We got the AGL Golden Frieza, who is phenomenal after his Extreme Z Awakening. So is Majin Vegeta. And uh, yeah, so that is two stones. And then for one stone, you can get one of the OG 120% leads or Fizz Vegito Blue and AGL Rosé. Now, in my opinion, Fizz Vegito Blue is actually the best available unit in the pool like including the category leads and also the lrs with his extreme z awakening right like he is honestly that good but the thing is he should be available on the lr vegeto banner so maybe do some summons there first see if you pull him and if not then he wouldn't be a bad pickup in my opinion and for these other 120 leads i mean you know they're quite old but the thing is a lot of them i mean they're all starting actually to get Extreme Z Awakenings on JP. They already got the Super Saiyan 3 Broly, or I think he's dropping soon, maybe tomorrow. And uh, you know, these guys, like the, the Cooler, the Janemba, the Super Saiyan 4, so on and so forth, will probably all have Extreme Z Awakenings within the next year or so. So they will get some pretty significant upgrades, even though Super Saiyan 3 Broly was like kind of disappointing to a lot of people. I still think he got a significant upgrade over what he used to be. So I wasn't that mad at it, and I expect a lot more from like Cooler, Super Saiyan 4s, um, you know, Go Tanks, so on and so forth. So, uh, if you guys are missing one of these guys, wouldn't be a bad choice either to pick them up. Okay, so these are one purple Dragonstone each, and that's pretty much it. So, once you buy your packs from the Stone Shop, just pop over to the Baba Shop and go over to the purple Stone Shop right there and pick up your, you know, units that you want, and that's all there is to it now i think if you have multiple stones you can buy like multiple you know 120 leads or you know like one 120 lead and category lead or something like that so that's always an option as well but that is all i gotta say in today's video guys i'm just happy honestly that like the purple dragon stone is finally confirmed it's finally here it's finally out and people can stop asking me questions about it and uh, i probably will pick up all three because i need the stones and I'm most likely going to pick up a copy of Goku Black because mine actually has no dupes. All the other guys are either rainbowed or have like two or three dupes. For some reason, Goku Black was the one that like always eluded me as far as dupes went. So I'm probably going to pick up a dupe for him. A dupe for him. And uh, yeah. Oh, by the way, before you go, let me know in the comments down below if you guys plan to pick up the purple dragon stones as well and which units are you going to buy it with your purple stones. All right. But... That's it. That's all I got to say. Hope you guys are hyped for the upcoming LR banners. I mean, they might be out already by the time you watch this video, but as I'm filming, we're still a couple hours out, like a couple hours before they drop. So uh, if you're watching this as soon as the video drops, hope you guys are hyped. And if you're watching it after, then hopefully you pulled some fire. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like, the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel and you like what you see then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the tiger squad now and while you're at it hit that notification bell too so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date up to date with all my latest content and oh real quick before we go there is one thing i want to say uh, i will be streaming my summons on the lr blue gogeta and lr blue vegeto banners as soon as they drop at 2 a.m eastern standard time so if you're watching this within the next like couple of hours after the video drops then make sure to tune in if you guys can if not then it's cool i'll post it on the channel but it's more fun to watch them live right so be there if you can and uh 
that's all i gotta say all right that's it the video the, the music is repeating which means i have to go <laughs> and uh until next time hope you guys have a fantastic fantastic day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out